many of the child COVID-19 deaths reported in Taiwan so far had complications caused by acute encephalitis. This side effect has not been seen in most other parts of the world. To find out more, I spoke with Zhang Guanyu, a visiting staff doctor with Taipei City Hospital. I began by asking Zhang what's behind the encephalitis. In the global experience, uh, it's a really uh, rare cases. But however, it's seemingly higher in Taiwan. The previous uh, similar experience is from Hong Kong, but it, there is just uh, two cases. It's about uh, COVID encephalitis uh, in child. The enterovirus type 71 uh, have caused uh, numerous uh, child encephalitis in previous time. And Taiwan's public health have dealt with this situation for a long time and have reported a lot of paper. And now we just uh, copy the model of the uh, enterovirus to the COVID. So uh, our CECC and some uh, specialists in pediatric uh, to integrate a platform to collecting all the data. Here in Taiwan, the Central Epidemic Command Center says the death rate among uh, child COVID patients is, I believe, 0.3 out of every 10,000. Uh, how does that compare to the child death rate in the rest of the world? Actually speaking, there, um, the chance of the child and similarities in COVID is crossing to, is similar to Zizo. There's uh, almost no cases globally. This is a, a special case in Taiwan, exactly. But however, I think it's a different presentation globally because uh, uh, in Europe and American society, the COVID caused child's hepatitis, uh, severe hepatitis. A special presentation in other country, but there is no case in Taiwan. So uh, in different countries, they have different problems. Some COVID-19 patients have exhibited long-term after effects, even after recovering. Will these children who get encephalitis and still recover, will they suffer long-term COVID-19 effects as well? It's a very interesting problem because the child who got the uh, virus uh, encephalitis um, is always uh, irreversible. It is our problem. Even we have the money tone, that means to uh, decrease the brain's pressure or uh, some steroid to uh, downgrade the information. So the long-term cause of the encephalitis, I think there's uh, no answer in Taiwan till now. This is a new phenomenon and we need time.